Hey, what's up guys? It's me, Illus. Welcome back to the channel. Before we go any further into this video, if you guys can take one second of your time, subscribe to the channel if you have not already, and drop a like on this video as well. You know, your support will be very appreciated. That will help out my channel a lot, so thank you all for that. So yesterday was a very special day for the long-awaited update Doom OS 3.0. The Doom officially released the Doom OS 3.0, but unfortunately, only a few people got selected, was able to test it first. But don't you worry, if you all left out like myself, and still have not get a beta email yet, I got you covered. Apparently, only the people on NetDuma R1 will receive the beta email first. So if you have the XO300, XO500, or the XO700, we are going to have to wait a little bit longer than we thought. Actually, it is up to NetGear now, not NetDuma. And I mean, it's no surprise here. So for now, we are going to have to wait a little bit longer. And I contact one of the NetDuma admin directly, and this is what he said. But first, I asked him any idea when Doom OS 3.0 will be available on Nedgy routers, and he replied back, I think it will be next week around the same time as for the R1. Nedgy are in charge of sending out firmware for Nedgy routers, but we'll send it to them next week when they choose to release it, it is up to them. So what does this mean for us who have the XO routers? It means that we are going to have to wait for one week before we receive the beta email, but why? That's when um, the NetDuma team will send them the beta firmware, then it will be up to Netgear when they want to release it. So for everyone out there who's confused why they have not received a beta email yet even though they sign up for it, like I said, we're going to have to wait for one week. That's when NetDuma will send Netgear Duma OS 3.0 firmware. And if you have all one, check your email. And if you still have not received you know, an email for the beta, you can contact NetDuma admin directly there they will give you their support you know to get the firmware asap so there you guys have it i know it kind of sucks but i'm actually disappointed i was looking forward to the firmware but now we have to wait again for another week before we can get our hands on it so i hope you guys enjoyed this quick update if you do make sure to drop a like subscribe to the channel if you haven't already again my name is the ls beast and i'll see you guys very soon peace out